I can make music with this. <laughs> <laughs> Discovering buttons. I have hold record. <laughs> oh, on! I turned it on. Mm. So point it, point it at the stone, and what does it say? At the stone, it's 72.5. Okay, oh, and you're right there. All right. Hey everyone, I'm Matt Newman, lead developer for Arkham Horror the Card Game, and I'm here with Nicholas Corey from the Mythos Busters podcast. And uh, we're here because someone in the marketing department thought it would be fun to send us on an actual ghost hunt. So we're here investigating the Wabasha Street Caves. Caves were carved out of the surrounding sandstone in the 1840s. And in the 1920s, the caves were used as a restaurant and a nightclub known as the Wabasha Street Speakeasy. And it's said that the speakeasy played host to a number of well-known gangsters, including Ma Barker and public enemy number one, John Dillinger. All right, so let's go inside and hopefully not find any of them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Shall we? After you. <clears throat> After you. Oh. All right, so we got all kinds of gadgets here for, for ghost hunting purposes. Authentic ghost hunting equipment. Right. Um, I've got a infrared thermometer. Um, so you can see it, if I turn it on and I point it at someone, you can get a reading on their temperature and you can, you can do that from pretty far away. So if like a spirit passes in front of it, we'll see it get really cold. All right, and then this is the infrared camera. This is Ghost Gun Plus. Okay, uh, luckily not anything showing up on it. Uh, other thing I've got is this uh, EMF meter. Um, I don't know exactly how it works, but supposedly um, I can detect, you know, you know paranormal activity and around the... Green for ghost, right? Green, no, green is good. Green is good. Green, for green good. you're in the clear. Red for ghost. Red, I'm out of here. Uh, so from what I understand, this chandelier is not the, the original chandelier that was in this building. The, the original one uh, just started swinging and shaking during a bar mitzvah and fell down from out of nowhere. Uh, luckily, no one was injured, but no one really understood how it could have happened. There was no wind or anything, and no one was pushing on it. So that's our first sign that you know something could be off here. Do you want to use this as a base of operations? Works for me. All right. Oh, I'm actually getting a spike. Oh, and it's gone. Wait, mm -hmm. is there a, is there a bartender here? We're not so lucky. It's pretty narrow. Oh, I don't like how claustrophobic this is. Hey, Matt! Oh, Jesus! <sighs> Nick, no, go, go ahead. I can see you. Go I, ahead so I can see you. You didn't see me just there, huh? I know, because you were around the corner. Go. Scary ghost. No, 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 no. This is the fireplace. So um, the story goes, there were men playing poker on one of these tables near the fireplace, and a bartender reported hearing a fight break out during the poker game. And um, then there were gunshots. Bartender runs in, three dead gangsters. Huh. Sees three dead gangsters lying on the ground. Runs to get the police. The police come in here, come back to tell her not to make false reports anymore. What? And that there were no dead gangsters here. And then when she comes back, everything's been scrubbed clean. Everything's been mopped. Wow. Yeah, so the only evidence of the, uh, the gun battle are the bullet holes. So there's one, yep. There's like a ricochet you can see. So I mean, if any room had ghosts, like definitively, you'd think it'd be this one, right? Uh, I mean, they were killed in this room, but supposedly they're buried uh, deeper in the caves. Really? The back, yeah. There's people buried here? Supposedly, yeah. I mean, we're gonna go check that out, right? No, we're not gonna go check that out. Yeah, we're totally gonna go do that. No. Yeah. No, I... Come on. Just this area. We're not even allowed back there. Oh, nobody will notice. Oh, here we go. What? This has to be the entrance to the caves. No. Or remain locked. Nick, we Come can't on. go back there. I'm telling I mean, you, we can't go back there. If it's locked, we'll turn around, right? Okay. But if it's unlocked, we're going in. If... Uh, well, it's locked, so you'll be fine. What was that? Nick? That sounded like it came from over here. <laughs> Dude, look at this. No way. Look at that. What is that? I don't know. What's well, a hot spot? It's a hot spot? I think it's calling us into the I, door. I think no, the ghosts no, no, want no, us no, to no, yeah, I don't like this. Let's go. Come on. <sighs> oh, thank oh. goodness. All right, you're off the hook this time. All right, good. Let's get out of here. I think we got to keep going. No, I'm No, out. I think we got to keep going. Or it's like, when I first turn it on, I always get a reading next to you. Well, 
well, I mean, unless it's detecting natural charisma, I don't know what to tell you. I don't think that's it. <sighs> that looks really creepy. I mean, it looks more exciting than anything we've seen so far. The bullet <sighs> holes were cool, but if there's actually people buried down here, we need to go take a look. After you? Yeah. Oh, I don't like any of this. This place is way too creepy, Nick. I think we should really go. We haven't found anything really, really worth it yet, you know? Don't you want to come back with something? We've found more than enough things, I think. Are there any spirits in here? Are there any spirits of the gangsters who were killed in the poker game? Are your bodies really buried here in the caves? Oh, it's cold in here. I'm getting something. Why are you still here? Nick, there's this crazy tunnel over here. It goes super deep. And I'm getting all kinds of hits on this. What's in there? Uh, I don't know. No, you know what? I'm out of here. I can't do this. <laughs> Let's get out of here.